So this may be one of my favorite uh, quad lock kind of announcements that I've seen in a while. I was pretty excited when this one uh, got released and uh, I've got a copy of it today. Uh, and it's actually the quad lock. You can see it here, right? Just so you know, if you've never done this before, you can get 10% off your first first order, which is awesome. Uh, it's the quad lock accessory mag wallet. So for those of us that have the quad lock case, especially with the, the mag accessory, it's kind of important to have on it. Um, you now can use this, which is the mag accessory wallet. And I'll talk to you about why I think this is so awesome. Uh, we'll look at here and we'll, we'll see, how it, see how it fits in the phone. Okay, so num number, this is probably the big one. I have reviewed and taken a look at on this channel, tons and tons and tons of uh, Apple iPhone um, MagSafe wallets. And there's a lot of them that are really great, nice leather wallets, et cetera, et cetera. But one of the biggest issues that I have with every last one of them is that it's a magnet that is attaching your wallet to the back of your phone through the through the MagSafe. And that wallet, of course, is only so strong. So can it come off? Yeah. And if it's got your three or four most important cards in it, then you do run that risk a little bit, right? Of possibly losing your wallet. Uh, or any other MagSafe attachment that you have on there because it's just attached with magnets. Now, I have used uh, quad lock gear on my motorcycle pretty much since quad lock became a thing. Uh, and I've never, ever, ever had an issue with my phone coming off the quad lock mount. You watch all my motorcycle riding videos and it's, it's sitting right there on my handlebars. My wife has it on hers. I've had it on all my motorcycles up to when I started. Um, and it's been fantastic. And that's probably the biggest thing is if you're gonna have a wallet attached to your phone, you don't want it to come off, right? So that's a big thing. This right now is $50, $50 US. And for those of us that are using the quad lock kind of ecosystem, this is a kind of a no brainer for me. Um, plus, you know what? Outside of the fact that uh, it's the, the mag compatible, right? Um, if you have an Android phone that has a, a quad lock on it, this this should be fine. Gives you gives you all those bells and whistles as long as you can get a quad lock case that fits. Um, so, anyways, this is it. This is it here, the Mag Accessory Wallet. Uh, yeah, because I've got I've got a couple trips coming up, of course, this this year, and. Um, I'm gonna bring my full wallet, wallet, of course, because I gotta bring, I'll bring a couple, like probably more cards than something like this can actually hold. But on little day outings and things like that, where I'm just like, no, I'm gonna be taking just a couple cards, like a credit card or debit card or my ID, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera right? Um, what does it say here? Secure hold, that's probably the biggest one. It's secure because it uses the quad lock locking mechanism, right? Which is awesome, stylishly designed. Payments made easy, use your card's tap to pay functionality without the need to remove from your card. Now, uh, it does say that if you have multiple uh, RFID cards in your wallet, this may become an issue. And I would think you would wanna put your primary card, the card that you use most, like for me is my debit card, would be the one that's on the most outside, so it's not blocked by the other cards that are that are in your wallet, right? So, um, fantastic, so here here it is. Now it does come with a little, little little warranty card. You guys can see it right there, a little warranty card, if that's something. I don't know what the warranty is on them. I'm sure it says on their, on their website somewhere. There it is, hey, right? Now my guess is they are, uh, it says push, okay? So they give you some cards, some fake cards, yes? So uh, my, my guess would be, and I'm guessing they would say, I would say just like a lot of these wallets, Probably three, three cards would be my guess as to uh, how many. I do like the fact that once you get them in there, they're in there, it's it's nice and snug. And then you just kind of push up with here. And then once you got them, you can do whatever. Now this is where a lot of times if it's on a phone, this is where you would break that magnet, right? It would kind of slide up off your phone. Again, if you're putting it in a pocket, there's especially like for those of us put it in our front pocket or things like that, or, or your 
someone that carries a bag or a purse or something around, it's so easy to knock this off. A normal one, not this one, because it has the quad lock mount on it. So this, you put in here, yes, right? This goes down and it's in there. So it doesn't, as far as I know, it doesn't spin on like you would with a quad lock because there's no way to disengage it, right? But because this, this piece here is in the grooves, right? That magnet is strong enough to keep it down. So if something were to knock it from the bottom, it can't go up because that's notches from the top can't go up from the side. It can't go over, which means that it stays aligned with those magnets all the time. So you have, let's pretend those are cards. You have those cards in here. Like I said, normally you'd have cards in here and pushing up. You would disengage this. This would pop off hundred percent, right? No, not popping off, not popping off. That, my friends, is a complete win. And if you're someone like me that does ride a motorcycle, I get to my motorcycle, I got my phone, I just can take this off, put it in my bag, put it in my pocket, whatever, go for a ride, click, click, in the car, click, click, cool. And then when I get back, boom. They should have thought of this years ago. What a great accessory. All right, guys, I'm going to leave links to Quadlock where you can take a look at this. Now, we have more Quadlock reviews for some of their other products. We have their new Quadlock battery, which is cool. And since we got a new ride, uh, we uh, got them to send us. Well, we asked. We didn't get them. They sent, they sent us. They're nice to us. Um, a, a car mount. So motorcycle has it. Personal has it. Car will have it. More reviews coming up. Later, guys.